All right, guys, I am back with level 15 now. So um, open up my skills here. You can see I'm 15 Hunter, which is pretty cool. Um, the next thing you're going to want to do is I'm going to show you really quick just how profitable Hunter is. I'm going to go back up to this bank that's up here by the teleport for Berthart. But if I just do a price check quick on the stuff that I have in my inventory that I made getting to level 15, I made 81,000 probably about 10 minutes. So. That just goes to show you how profitable Hunter is at even an extremely low level that I, like what I'm at right now. Um, I'm going to go grab a butterfly net now so I can go ahead and get this going quick. And we need to trade with the Hunter lady. Hunter lady! We need the butterfly net and we're gonna buy all the butterfly jars that she has so super cheap still I'm gonna wield this now get rid of the new swan because I won't need that good money with the new swan but not really the best experience and I want to get to swamp lizards because those are decent experience and and pretty good money so uh, I'm going to first let's th let's get all these out um, another useful thing if you guys don't know it exists is if you click this sword that shows kind of a note it'll say switch to note withdrawal mode so you click that and you can see it's clicked in if I take all these out now they'll all be stacked in just one one clean stack rather than 27 things in the inventory so I'm gonna go back to Varrock here I'm gonna sell these furs and then I'll show you guys how to get to the Crimson Swifts which I believe those are It'll be a little bit of a hike to get over there, I think, for sure. Those are like on the opposite side of the map, so we'll unlock some lodestones on our way over there. I'll show you guys where all those are, but I'm going to go up to the Grand Exchange here quick and, and sell these. And then I can maybe... Well, with 80,000 I can buy a little bit of stuff, maybe, for training. Actually, I bet, could buy quite a bit of stuff. Wow, I could train herb, herb quite a bit already. This bonus XP, what I'd recommend with a normal account um, starting out is get prayer first to 95. And then after 95 prayer, start working on herb to get overloads, which require 96 herb. But since it's bonus XP right now, I'm going to do herb first just because it's extremely fast. And prayer doesn't really get a bonus when you get the two times experience. So there we go, we got 85k for that. I'm gonna go ahead and buy some guam. Uh, what are grimy at? Grimy, clean guam, 435. And, uh, I need guams. So I'll we'll take clean guam and I'll take out 143k. I'm gonna make these here really quick. Uh, buy it all. Of water. And I want 100. Whoops. That works, I guess. Get that money back, and then I need I have moot. Alright, so I take all those, and now this is another skill. Um, if you look at the skill guide, I'll show you guys once I finish making these, but basically how it works is you can find these herbs throughout RuneScape. As you kill things, uh, you can get seeds and do farming with them. I am going to take the guams and use them with the vial of water, and you'll see I get a guam potion unfinished. So I'm going to make all these really quick. And then what you do after this is take the secondaries and to find out how to make potions or what potions require for the herb and what they require for the secondary all you have to do is go to your skill guide here and you can look at attack potion that's the only thing I can make I'm level one right now it requires a guam and an eye of newt it always goes into a water filled vial for this stuff so now I'm gonna take and grab my eye of newts and this is gonna be so much experience I'm pretty excited about this actually on bonus XP training herb is going to be so nice. I'm going to get so many levels. Just off of these 100 actually, starting out too, is going to be... I'm already level 5 now. Yeah, level 5 herb. 
Level 6 off one inventory. That's not bad. 14 and 14. But Hunter is one of those skills that you can't be AFK for, as I kind of said earlier, but the money that you make from not being AFK while training it is absolutely phenomenal. I mean, it's just really, really, really good money that you make doing this. As you can see, I made 80k in about 10, 5 to 10 minutes or so. So, the XP, you would have made about 160k on a normal account if you had done that, because it's obviously it's double XP right now. Bonus XP is active, so... I'm getting more experience for Hunter than I normally would have, so I would have made about 180 had I been a normal account and not on um, bonus XP weekend starting out. Just keep going with this, see what level we get to. It's a good start though, for sure. Brand new account that I started about maybe an hour ago. I'm already level 13 now. Er, pretty sick. And as I get Swamp Lizards, I'll probably just be investing in Herb all this weekend. So I'll show you how to get up to Swamp Lizards, and then I'll obviously be catching them as, as I go through the weekend. But I'm going to show you Divination 2 and how I was talking about that you can get Porters, which are items that automatically bank certain items in RuneScape. I'm going to show you how to get those and and how you can how you can make pretty good money doing hunter even even investing maybe about an hour or two in just leveling to get there you can make probably about 5 600k an hour doing it so maybe more right now I don't know with with the bonus xp um, I could make actually even more cuz that's what these the items that I'm going to catch are called swamp lizards and um, in bonus XP they're worth even more because it's a secondary, it's the best Crimson Charm familiar you can make until you get to a pack yak. so really 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 good I'm already level 16, I'm right Maybe I'll get 20, close to 20, hopefully. I'm almost 100 total already. Oops, I don't want to do that. I want those out. I need those out. These are actually some of the worst. Herb XP you can get as well. So I'll do, I'll maybe be doing like Renars or something like that for my Herb XP since those are pretty decent. We'll see how how the weekend goes for for leveling. I'm probably gonna play on this account most of the weekend and I'll get these videos uploaded as I kind of make them. So yeah, we'll definitely get to 20, maybe even 21. This is the last inventory I'm going to do, and then I'll go catch those butterflies. Do, do, do. Hooray! 20 herb! Oh, 21. Oh, no, just kidding. Now 21. Now 21! Cool. So in about 10 minutes, I got to 21 herb now. <laughs> That's pretty cool actually. Um, so I'm going to take all my butterfly jars out, and now I'm going to show you guys how to get across this area. So there's going to be probably about five or six lodestones I'm going to open up as I walk over here. All very, very useful to have. So I'll be right back once this teleport gets done.